Hey, what's up? Husman here. And today I'm gonna take you with me through a normal day for me. I like a day in the life of a music producer. I've got a lot of questions about what do you do in a day and how do you, do you have a job on the side? Is this your real job? Well, it's actually my real job. I graduated as a music producer as well. And as some of you might know, I've started my own production company where I do some client work. So I thought it would be fun to show you around what I do in a day. Today is actually the 19th of February. It's a Tuesday. I always wake up between 6.45 and 7 o'clock in the morning. It's most of the time 7 o'clock. My first alarm goes at 6.45, but I like to snooze a little bit, so I have a little bit of a feeling that I can sleep out just a little. At 7 o'clock I wake up, and the first thing that's really important, I rush down the stairs to my coffee machine and make me a fresh cup of coffee, because I really need that little caffeine booze in the morning. Now, after I got my cup of coffee, head over to the studio, settle in a bit, and then start with the boring stuff. So I'll check all my emails, I set up meetings, I check all the notes from the clients, and after that's done, it's time to do the really creative stuff because now I don't have to worry about all the other stuff that's less important at the moment when making music. At 7.30 I start client work and this is the work that I do for my company NH Productions. This is a company that I started I think two years ago. I do all kind of stuff, mixing, mastering, partial productions, complete production. This can be for all kinds of artists, but now I've been working more with brands as well. So making some little jingles, making some background music which I do enjoy a lot because it's a whole different kind of process. At 8 30 I always take my dog out for a walk. In case you're interested I have a Rottweiler. His name is Bruce. He's now I think four years old. It's for me and for him always a great way to stretch the old legs a little bit. When I get back from walking my dog at 9 I always work until 10. Further on the client work that I've started at 7 30. At 10 o'clock I eat breakfast. Today I had some yogurt, some fruits, some nuts, some muesli, I think it's, don't know if it's, that's the same way it's called in English. After I had some breakfast, it's time for another round of coffee. I work further for client work until 12. At 12 o'clock I'm gonna head to the gym where I'm gonna get a workout in. It's for me really important to stay fit, stay healthy and when being a producer you're just sitting in your studio all day which is really terrible for your body. So I really like to get at least four or five workouts in every week three workouts and then two times do boxing which is something i really love to do like for a year now now when i get back from the workout and have some shower i'm gonna work until two and two it's time for lunch i always eat wraps in the afternoon which i really love i can do all sort of things on it most of the time we put some chicken some tuna some eggs some cabbage some cu some cucumbers anything that's really healthy and really fills my body up again to work on further projects. Now after lunch it's time to work on my own productions. I've normally always used the mornings to work on client work and then after the workout, after the lunch, I'm gonna work more on my own stuff. So at the moment I'm working on a really uplifting big room kind of track. So here's a little sneak peek. At 3 o'clock it's time again to walk my dog. Again around 30 minutes. After walking the dog I'm gonna head back into the studio, grab me a cup of coffee and then work until 5.30. And then it's time to cook some dinner. Today we're gonna eat some Slavinken. I have no idea how to say that in English but look it up, it's really tasty. We have some potatoes, we have some... what do we have? Some spinach, so we can get some pop high vibes in. The cooking always takes around 30 minutes and then at 6 o'clock my girlfriend comes home, we eat together and then after dinner I continue working until around 8 o'clock and then it's time for some me time, some chill time. I usually go watch a movie with my girlfriend or play some video games and just have a little relaxing evening. At the end of every day I always check my schedule and just check what's up for the next day and then that's about it what I do every day. I think it's really important at least for me to have consistency with what I do. Since I'm self-employed it's really easy to fall into the trap to just sleep in late and just don't wake up early but for me at least I really have to put in the hours to really make this self-employment work and really make a living with music. So that's what a basic day for me looks like. Just 
wake up early, work until normal hours and then some chill time and be ready for the next day. My day usually ends at like 11, 12 and then it's time to head to bed. So this is what I do almost every day. It's really, it sounds really repetitive, but as you know, producer, we do all kinds of different stuff. We do all kinds of different music, different genres. And for me, it's a really fun way to keep myself busy. Normally I would work a little bit in the weekends, but never for clients, only for my own music, because I think Making music is my hobby, it's my job as well, but I really love to do it. So for me, it almost doesn't feel like a job, but I treat it as a job. And that's why, for me at least, it is working. I really hope you enjoyed this little insight of what I do in a day. And if you like what I do, hit that like button. If you haven't already, subscribe. Now, should you want to be notified whenever I post a new video, there's a cool little bell which you can hit or tickle. And then I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care, bye-bye. Yeah.